Welcome to another Mad Human Pizza video. Here's a snapper self-propelled lawnmower. And here is the oil dipstick area. It's right by the pull string here. So twist that, pull it off, and then you'll you want to check the oil level. The little finger finger aerobics right here. See if I can get that to focus. There we go. As you can see, it is just above the first hole, which is good. It's a little dirty, a little dirty oil. So what we're going to do is single-handedly. I could get the um, tripod. That's too much work. So we're going to clean that end off. Clean the end off, and then we're going to put it back in the hole, like so, and then now we'll get a good reading here. So it is just, if I can stop shaking, just after, just in the middle actually, that's a good reading, as you can see. All right, so the oil level is just above the first hole on the left and before the second hole. So that's a good reading. That oil is uh, pretty good. And there's a certain amount of time, hours. I'll look it up and I'll get that information to you. All right, for best lawnmower engine performance, you should change oil after the first five hours. of use for a new mower then at least once every spring or summer mowing season or every 50 hours of operation whichever comes first make sure you have the right supplies before you begin okay so what I've uh, found out was every 15 to 50 between 20 20 and 50 hours of uh, running operation is when you need to change the oil or every season. So I guess use it for a season if you're just casually using it and then the next season change the oil. And there's three different ways to change it. There's a, uh, you can use an extraction tool where you uh, vacuum it out with a, a pump and stuff. That seems kind of fun. Or you can tilt the mirror on its side and on its side like that where the oil drains out of the dipstick holder area or there's a drain plug on here which I have yet to I haven't changed the oil on this thing yet um, so I have yet to do it but uh, I'm sure it can't be too bad okay so whenever I change the oil on this you want to want to make sure you run the engine until the gas until it shuts off. There's no more gas in there because you don't want because we're going to be tilting the whole lawnmower towards the oil filler neck, like so. It'll be going this way, and the oil will just drain out via gravity into a catch container of sorts. And then uh, make sure you disconnect the spark plug before you do so. Um, that's what it says in the manual, disconnect the spark plug, which is, uh, right here. So you just pull that off the boot, and then, uh, it'll be disconnected. And then you'll just, uh, because, uh, you don't want fuel run, run down whenever you tilt, tilt the engine, and then the oil will leak out, and then you add oil. Um, Alright, since my audience, my audience is mostly guys, um, Here's how we vacuum, all right? Just have that set up like that. That way you can just throw those on and you don't have to hurt your ears. So you put those on, just pretend I put them on. And then, uh, so this model is very simple. Look at this. Just push that, it comes out, and then it empties by pushing in that tab right there and it'll come out the bottom. And then you can take that middle thing out, out too. And then to put it back, you just kind of push it in like that. And, uh, pretty much just, uh, pull back, go like that. 
see how it locks up like that and then you, you plug it in now this is cool too over here on this light on over here right here look at this you go like that takes everything down and then right here so you just plug it in and then as i showed you before pull back push down and then the power button is right right here and when you're done this is cool too so you just flip this up like that and then it, you can easily put back this cord and I'm, I'm doing with one hand right here uh, if I'm doing it with one hand it's really easy with two hands so, and then when you get to the end you put this, this is cool right here look at this see that on the end of that it snaps on you can snap it on it ends down here which sucks but Depends on how tight you wound it. But you can just put this, see that right there? Just get that on there, see it like that? Right there, see that? And then, like that. And then there's already dirt in there. But uh, I'll show you. So, let me turn the light on. Put the trash can here. Pizza box in there. Push this in, and uh, like that. And it'll all come out. And then you can take that red, red, that red, or the that red thing out in the middle if you want. Um, yeah, I think I will. I will just give that a couple twists, and uh, of course I drop some on my foot because I'm trying to do this with one hand, which is that. Mess, pretty much the big mess. So, uh, just barefooted and not pregnant. So we're gonna put this in here. And uh, I mean, if I was female, I'd probably be pregnant, but I'm not. So it is what it is. So here it is. And this stupid thing, when you twist it on, you can see how it twists on like that. See that it goes in, and you twist it, so it, it'll go in right there. And then it'll twist down that slot. I'll show you. There's still some dirt in there, but we don't have to be too picky. So we put that on the middle of the shaft. See that shaft down there? It goes in the middle down there. I'm gonna have to clean that up. But uh, let's get over here. Go on there, twist it until you feel it twist. All right, I felt it twist, and then to close it, you'll hear it snap, and then, uh, watch this. Oh, I missed it. Dang it. Oh, I tried to do it with one hand. I couldn't do it with one hand. It goes right straight on down there. You can actually see the groove on that thing down there. Watch the holes line up down there. They go on there. Once it's on there, it snaps on. We'll do it. We'll be smart about this. And, uh, let me get that sock there. All right. See that? That was some monkey, monkey crap I did right there with my feet. And you can clean this out too down here. See this? This comes out. This comes out. You can wash that and clean it. I did that the other day. That's pretty much as clean. It's pretty clean. And this goes on just like that. It snaps on. Good to go. Stupid thing. And there. There you go. All right, don't forget to put these back. There you go, it sits, it sits right up on there, there you go.